Welcome back, I'm Rob Lang and this is my game Clomper. You live inside a mechanical ladybird called a Clomper, which you can control by laying pipes to power machines with steam. The outside world is a hellscape that you explore from inside the Clomper, picking up resources and completing quests. If that sounds like fun, like and subscribe for more. This week we rotate meshes, do away with wireframes and implement set pieces. Up until now, I had separate meshes for each of the corner and wall tiles. That's a bit wasteful, because they're the same mesh rotated four times. I'd rather just make one corner piece and let the game rotate it inside Unity. I cut back my Blender model to this and use this code to rotate. You might need to round off your vertices to the nearest two decimal places as float multiplication can leave you with accuracy errors. One side effect is that the flat pieces are also rotated four times, which makes it look like the same piece over and over. But that's okay though, eventually they'll have more detail and features, so rotation will look better. The wireframes have been useful for understanding the algorithm, but before I go further, I needed to spawn in some solid meshes. The meshes appear when wave function collapse is decided on a tile and despawn at the last possible moment. For chuckles, I added a simple driving script to the clomper and got a sense of the environment for the first time. The next feature I wanted to create is a set piece. A set piece is a specially designed location that is a seamless part of the world, but not built procedurally. This set piece is 2x2 two two and inserted away from the landscape that has already been built. Wave function collapse has run round the edge of the set piece, but no tiles have been decided on yet. As the clomper approaches, wave function collapse knows that the set piece is there, so choose tiles accordingly. I've kept the material different, so we can see the boundary for now. Behold the majesty of placeholder graphics. I do hope you can see past this austere ugliness to the power of the algorithm. If you can, hit like, and if you'd like to see more, hit subscribe. Questions, feedback, and demands to fix it in the comments. Until next time, stay safe. Bye bye.